Welcome and Sat Nam. This is a very special Kriya that I'm going to be sharing with you today. It is called Master Set. It's something in the Kundalini world that we like a lot because it does a lot. It is a strong metabolic and glandular supporter. It is a total reset if you're having adrenal fatigue, hormonal issues, fatigue issues, emotional issues, because all of those things are controlled by our hormones and our glands are the things that support the hormones. So we go right back to the source and this set helps reset and heal the glands that secrete, you know, insulin, cortisol, estrogen, um, you know, human growth hormone, all the things that we need. This helps balance them and gets you back to a homeo place of homeostasis. Personally, I am on also day 60. I'm going for 120 days. I give this set all the time to clients who have any kind of adrenal or hormonal issues or weight loss frustration issues. It's usually a hormonal imbalance. So this, once people get into this set, they start to notice they're losing a ton of weight. And it's not because you're burning a ton of calories. It's because you're going back to the source and healing it. So I'm very excited to share it with you. And again, master set one is what it's called. If you want to look it up and do a really deep dive, it's all on the internet. You can find any of this information. So what we're going to do is just tune in cat cow to warm up, and then it's only three postures. So they're, I'll show you lots of modifications. They're challenging. And it's good that you have a glass of water somewhere near you just because there's a lot of breath of fire. If you are on the first or second day of your cycle, you're just going to do long, slow, deep breaths, but still do every single posture. Okay. Bring the palms together into the heart, sternum, press, inhale, exhale, inhale to tune in. Om Namo Guru Dev Namo Om Namo Guru Dev the tongue to the roof of your mouth, elbows wide, thumbs to sternum, sit tall like a great yogi and pull up through that pelvic floor. Exhale, inhale for protection mantra. Ad gude name, jugad gude name, sat gude name, siri gude name, vin name, ad gude name, jugad gude name, Sat gude name, siri gude de vin name, ad gude name, jugad gude name, sat gude name, siri gude de vin name. Inhale. Hold and squeeze, pull up through the root lock, the mula band, pull the energy up the spine, every muscle like steel, and mind is clear and neutral. Good, and release. Okay, let's go ahead and make our way onto all fours for cat cow, which again, I believe everyone should be doing this every day of their lives. It's really good for preventing wrinkles and for keeping our spine healthy. Our spine is our pathway from the brain to everything in our body, so that makes sense. Inhale up, exhale down. If you want to introduce the mantra, it's Sat Nam, Sat Nam.
Deeper breath now, please. Deeper, deeper, deeper. And keep going. While you're doing this, you should be hearing the sound and loving the sound of your own breath. And work from the base of the spine. So really move from the tailbone and then let that undulate up through the whole cat cow. One more moment left, keep going. Keep going nice and strong, as fast as you can here in these last 30 seconds. I want you to really feel like you're moving, you're moving the energy, you're moving the breath. Go faster, go faster, last 10 seconds. Deep breath, fast pace, move the spine for three, two, one. Inhale up, hold the breath, apply the mula bond, lift the heart, lift the chin, don't breathe, squeeze. Now exhale, tuck the chin, tuck the glutes, squeeze and round to the back. Now inhale, neutral. Exhale, press back, forehead to the earth, hands above you. The next posture is in child's pose, so you can have your knees together or not. And if you find this challenging, you can go ahead and tuck a pillow underneath your belly, because we're gonna have the head lifted and the palms by our sides and the breath is breath of fire so ready let's go eyes are shut breath is inhale exhale inhale exhale nice and strong so we're here for the next three minutes. I want you to go to a place of a neutral mind. I'm gonna stop talking and allow you to have an experience. I'll let you know when to inhale. So until then, get lost, hold the posture to the best of your ability and pump the navel, breath of fire.
Little bit faster breath, last 10 seconds. Go strong, hold the posture, perfect the posture. And inhale, deepest breath yet. And hold and squeeze the mula ban, tongue to the roof of your mouth, every muscle like steel. Don't breathe, hold the breath in, squeeze it. And exhale, release. Okay, continue to rest. I just realized. <laughs> you might need a cushion for the next posture. We are going to take the knees a little bit wider and continue with breath of fire. But for some of you, it may just be back like this because you're going to come back as far as you can. You can place your bum on the inside of the heels a little, but I don't want your knees super wide and all, you know, if it's going to hurt your knees. So, I got my timer here. Come back, three minutes, breath of fire. Come as flat as you can. I like to just put a cushion underneath my shoulder so I feel supported. Hands are by your side, eyes shut, breath of fire. So again, for some of you, it may just be here. You can come onto the elbows. Four, come all the way back. Using the mantra Sat Nam if you need to, to help anchor you. Please stay with the breath, listening to the sound of your own breath. Be honest with the position. We don't want to overdo it, but we do want to stay and do our best. It's only three minutes. If the breath is becoming too much, just take a break and then get back going as soon as you feel composed. Keep going, we still have one more moment left. This position is really playing at the balance that we carry as women in our thighs and our hips and think about our two glandular systems it's working at the thyroid and then the adrenals which sit right on top of the kidney so they're getting a total squeeze and flush right now it's really powerful keep going 40 seconds left <laughs> The breath of fire is cleansing the blood as we go through these postures. Inhale, pull on the pelvic floor, rectum, sex organs, navel, squeeze, hold the breath. Exhale, slowly make your way up. Bring the knees together, just place your hands on your lap and just take a moment, eyes are shut. And now for our last position is what we call a kundalini chair pose. Sip of water if you use it. So 
You take your legs about shoulder width apart. I'm just gonna do it this way so you can see my back. And you come down, you wrap your arms around and place them on your feet. Now, if that's too much, you can just have your hands, I don't know if you can see with my flowy pants, but just here behind you. And you're gonna try to get your back nice and flat so we're not collapsed and rolled. So if this is too much, you just bring your elbows onto your knees like this. And then we're gonna stick our tongue out as far as we can and continue with that breath of fire, but we call it lion's breath or dog's breath. So get ready, choose your position. I've been doing this for a while. So wrap all the way around, tongue out, eyes shut. To, but do your best to do the whole three minutes, eyes shut. tongue out, exhale, <sighs> inhale, hold, hold the posture, perfect the posture, squeeze the breath, pull up through the mula band, hold and squeeze, stick the tongue all the way out, exhale, <sighs> last time, hold, inhale, hold the posture, squeeze the body, you can do this, hold, exhale, tongue out, and slowly release, stretch the legs out for a moment if you need to, right away come into a cross-legged position, Bring the arms up, stacked, and just notice your experience. Mm -hmm. 
This is present moment awareness. Wahe Guru. Now, I want you to take a long, slow, deep breath and mentally in your head, you're gonna say, hut, 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 as many times as you can. And then you exhale and you say in your head, Hari, 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 Hari. Inhale, Hud, 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 Hud. As many times as you can say it while you inhale. Exhale, Hari, 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 Hari. Inhale, exhale. Once you get more comfortable with these, I'd like for you to be able to stay there as long as you need. It's a beautiful moment with such beautiful clarity. Bring the palms together. We'll close with one satnam. Satnam.